A former director general of the National Intelligence Agency, Mr. Yodili Oke, is reportedly scheming to be made the national security advisor by President Bola Tinobu. Sa reporters learned on Sunday that Oke who hid over $43 million in an apartment in Lagos and got booted out of office was trying to use his closeness to the president to secure the appointment. In April 2017, Sahar reporters reported that Oke hid over $43 million dollars from both the then president and national security advisor the former nia director okay who hid 43 million naira in the Kony apartment is reportedly back and scheming to be made nsc apparently he is close to tinumbu and he is trying to use that a top source said okay was widely reported to have claimed that the current nsc general babangida mogono was aware of the existence of the money but authoritative government sources told the newspaper that what happened is significantly different from that claim sources said okay he did not uh, did not did not brief the nsa about the existence of such funds or the project they were meant for when president muhammadu buhari's administration took office in may 2015 even though the money was released in march of the same year the NSA office, it was Lance only got its first knowledge of the existence of such funds during the work of the Presidential Committee that audited the defense equipment procurement in the armed forces. The committee had observed certain payments from the Central Bank of Nigeria to the NIA and raised questions which drew the attention of the NSA to the issues. It was learned that when the suspended DG of the NIA discovered that a committee was raising questions to prevent the NSA from blowing the cover, he then gave his first report to the NSA of the existence of such firms and warned that the committee's job did not cover the activities or the spending of the NIA. It was also learned that the project which the former president approved the funds totaling $289 million, included two in Lagos, whose costs were put at about $28 million, which is way less than the $43 million cash found in the Kui apartments. Sahara reporters had further reported that sources explained that as of January 2017, funds for the Lagos project had actually been released to the tune of $18 million, meaning only about a 10 million dollar was left to be paid for months earlier before over 43 million dollar was found in the Lagos apartment in november 2017 the anti-corruption body economic and financial crimes commission announced that it was inviting okay for questioning meanwhile okay had been sacked as an nia chief by president buhari about six months after he was first suspended his suspension came after the EFCC found about $43.45 million in the Lagos apartment. The commission later said the house where, where the money was found was rented in the name of Oke's wives for Lashadi. It later secured a court order to ensure the money was forfeited to the Nigerian government. A panel led by then Vice President Yemi Shibajo later recommended Oke's dismissal after looking into the circumstances during the cash haul. In March 2019, the EFCC declared Oke and his wife Olasha they wanted after they failed to answer for fraud charges filed against them. Justice Tukuji Aneke of a federal high court in Lagos had issued an arrest warrant against the duo. Consequent upon an oral application by Rotimi Oyedepo, the EFCC counsel, okay, and his wife were declared wanted in connection with the $43 million and $23 million naira cash recovered by the EFCC from the Lagos apartment in 2017, April. One of the counsel says that you, Ambassador Ayodeleoke and Mrs. Falashade, Ayodeleoke between 25th day of August 2015 and second day of September 2015 in Lagos within the jurisdiction of this court directly converted $160 million property of the federal government of Nigeria to your own use which some 
you reasonably ought to have known formed part of process of an unlawful act or to wit criminal breach of trust and you thereby committed an offense contrary to section 15 of 2d of the money laundry prohibition amendment act 2012 and punishable under section 15 of 3 of the same act <clears throat> okay when are they tell people say <clears throat> If there's anybody that needs to fight corruption or that wants to make Nigeria better, to be free or to have a good image, he's not in Umbu now. Forget it now. He's not in Umbu. It's just that uh, we have those who are, we know those who are tribalistic when it comes to issues. That is when they will tell you, oh, some people don't even, they don't support themselves. Oh, some people, they don't have respect. Some people, some region don't do this and this and that. They know this thing, no. The same set of people as at last year. They they were pressing, they've been pressing their neck for close to how many decades, all of a sudden, because of their tri- I, I cannot see the reason why some people are like, okay, this set of people who are supporting Tinubu are tribalistic in nature. As soon as they just saw that a uh, other, maybe as fate we have it, we have a Igbo uh, presidential candidate, we have a another presidential candidate, all of them started taking positions and all of that. Hmm. We cannot see, they are not supporting. Supporting such a person that has a this a baggage is I always said it. You talk about that PBS you know, is sick. Mm, to me, person way sick go where now. Mm mm. Mm. Person way sick now. He go where? No doubt it. That one is not. To me, it's not really a big deal. It could be part of it. But in as much as the person is going in and but well, it's not. I'm not saying it's really. It's not really something that can be talked about. But to me, it's not the main thing for me. But when I look at the antecedents of somebody of that nature, the same set of the same kind of person is even receiving money. This time that was when they started creating many many allowances, uh, per, uh, per pension, and what do they call it? Gratuity for people who just serve for eight eight years. And if you get and check the what they are collecting as salaries or allowances, you can't even see. You can't even. You will not be able to breathe unless you just. Want to just enjoy yourself. The same kind of person want to clean this re- clean this Nigeria. And you see, because a lot of all these, uh, what do they call them? All these ex convicts like Ibori and the rest of them, those who have baggages here and there, those who have EFCC, case with EFCC, they are the ones at the end of affair. And you expect Nigeria to be better. Forget it. Forget it. See, today what happened? They just dismiss somebody that did that kind of a thing. If not an ordinary person, and nobody go don't throw and put for J. So they only dismissed him. Whether they even dismiss him. Ah, it's unfortunate. <laughs> very, very unfortunate. Government for the baddest boys. If you do no bad, don't come close though. You must be bad and with evidence. <laughs> for you can say so this ah, government is hitting the ground on the look of them. That this person, person will carry bullion van, koro koro like this. This is what is called money laundry. He didn't deny it too. And someone I say, leave him alone. You see, your father's money missing. Did did I say, eh? <laughs> ah, that is zoo Nigeria for you. All the people that supported this man will cry later. How can corruption fight corruption? They will not cry, oh. I don't think they are because they are where. But because of their tribalistic nature, that is why they are trying to defend. It's not as if they are not aware. They are aware. Tell me what have they gained? What did they have gained? Even they themselves, they will say, oh, some, this one made this person. There's nobody. In one way or the other, you will help people. There's nobody that is highland of everything. Even if it, it is only by financial, uh, financial help, you de- render somebody before you know that you have helped somebody. We, there are a lot of help, helps, help every, you know, in various places, in various ways. It is some people don't need money. There are some things that some help that money will not be able to solve. There are some problems that money will not be able to solve. And you have somebody who is just on the street that will help you. You will just be appreciating it. Hi, thank you. Thank you. Not because of money. So you come and tell me hey, this and then we help this person. He made this person. What did he do in Yoruba land? What can the Yoruba people point out that he did? And you come and be telling me. It's not as if they don't know. They are aware. They are aware of these baggages. It's not. It's what everybody is aware of, but because of the kind of system you have in this place now, they will cover it for you. Especially if you are on the part of the, you are with the government of the day. This is very nice. Okay, must go. Go where? His reward for helping his principal launder public funds, yes, to secure money and keep things secret. Had he been, he was national security uh, security advisor. Then nobody would have discovered the money. Drug baron must put his 
likes. <laughs> so guys, let's say your opinion and have your take on this. Thank you.